So I just recorded a bunch of drum loops using this beautiful vintage reel-to-reel -reel tape machine. And one thing that I learned the hard way is that tape is indeed very noisy. So I'm gonna show you what I did to tame some of the noise a little bit. What I ended up doing was employing the Isotope RX audio editor to do some spectral denoise as well as the spectral repair tool at times. So let's take a look at that real quick. So if you open the track in RX, you basically want to find a little section that has empty space where it's just going to be the noise. And you want to highlight that so that the spectral denoise module can learn what you're looking to get rid of. You can already see it's get rid of a lot of information there. So we're just going to get rid of all of that. The other issue I ran into, which I noticed after the fact, was my kick pedal was like squeaky. So I was like, all right, I bet RX can get rid of that. You know, you see the transient, and then right after that, there's this little noise that's a little higher. So in my head, I'm like, all right, that's probably the kick pedal. And I just started highlighting it and deleting it. And it actually sounded all right. And I got away with that for a little bit. But then I ended up noticing this spectral repair module here. You want to use the frequency and time tool so you don't have to highlight all of the frequency. You can highlight just a little range of it. All right, you see the kick transient, and then you want to highlight the little part after that. You're basically telling it to look to the surrounding areas and then use what information is there to fill in the area that you're deleting, essentially. You can increase the strength of how hard you want it to be erased. And you're going to have to mess around with it a little bit, but I got pretty awesome results, as you can see here.